you've got this building that you know EF2, EF3. But look at look at to the, the the house that's just next to it, right? That's the other one he was talking about. That house and the church beyond it was completely destroyed, and that would be more in the direct path. So all these data points and these data sets that he's talking about is something that they use to analyze the entire storm path. And, uh, and ultimately give us a rating. In fact, I have one more question before we go to break. Hey, James, sorry, I, I, I had one question pop up. Do we know um, track length yet, how long this was on the ground? Do you guys know? Uh, I, heard, I read somewhere it was an hour and 50 minutes on the ground, but um, do you guys have any of that yet or no? For Pulaski County and Laurel County, it was about 52 miles. 52 miles right. in those counties that's, on the ground. There's going to be an additional path link addition for the Russell County side, okay. which is handled by the Louisville office. So probably be a few more miles than 52, but we've got about 52 and a quarter for Pulaski County and Laurel okay. County. Yeah. Thank you guys so yeah, much. I appreciate yeah. that because yeah. I'm just curious. I mean, I know that this storm system just traveled so far. Uh, best of luck today. Yeah, All right. Clear. Stay safe this afternoon and this evening. Um, all right. So anyway, it gives you guys some perspective of what it's like. And that's why, you know, it's a great relationship to have us in the weather industry, just working with each other. Those guys, they do so much for us and, and their jobs are definitely needed. So it's, uh, it's great to see that they're out there helping each other.